I'm Marissa Bailey. Here are the stories making headlines at this hour. Federal, state and local investigators are now working together to try to determine what sparked a fire that killed a 38 year old woman very early this morning in West Englewood. Firefighters were called to the home on 57th and Troop just after midnight by neighbors who saw flames shooting from a second story window. Friends and neighbors have been outside the building all morning consoling each other. Very special, Obviously, sweet. A lot of people out yes, you see, you see the community. She yeah. loved, very loved. We are all saddened by the loss of her, but we still will always have her loving spirit in our hearts. <laughs> A short time ago, a police canine was brought to the scene and an SUV could be seen being towed away. Earlier, a neighbor did tell us he saw the fire coming from an air conditioning unit in the window. Fire says that's certainly something they're looking at. They also tell us there were no working smoke detectors in the apartment. Well, hundreds of people lined the streets of Sun Prairie, Wisconsin, to honor a firefighter who died in the line of duty. Thirty four year old Captain Corey Barr died in a house explosion Tuesday night. A line of fire trucks escorted the hearse carrying his body as it made one last trip to his fire station and finally to the funeral home. Firefighters say the explosion was caused by a contractor who hit a natural gas line. The gas somehow ignited, leveling half a city block. Captain Barr helped more than 100 people get out of that danger zone just before the explosion. You're all just making glares here now with a look at your Thursday forecast. Hey there, Marissa. We have 89 degrees, the high temperature today. Humidity expected to build through the day today. More humidity in place by tomorrow, and we're going for a high today of 89. Tomorrow, 93 degrees. That's going to feel really hazy, hot, humid, sticky, uncomfortable. We're looking for probably heat index values upwards of around 100 possible. On Friday, we'll stay hot and humid into the weekend, adding a chance of some scattered showers and storms Saturday, Sunday, and Monday. Megan, thank you and keep it right here on CBS Chicago for updates throughout the day. Have a good Thursday.